the touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. This video will provide an overview of the home screen, its features, and functions. Starting at the top left of the screen, you'll find a row of icons that act as shortcuts to features and settings of your Tesla that will always remain stationary while interacting with the touchscreen. The padlock icon visually shows that your doors are currently locked or unlocked and, when touched, will lock or unlock all doors. The electric bolt brings up your vehicle's charging preferences. The home icon shows all your Homelink connected garage doors, gates, lights, or security systems. Up to three of these devices can be controlled by your Tesla. The person icon is a shortcut to access valet mode and driver profiles. Valet mode restricts access to your vehicle when handing it over to a valet. Driver profiles allow you to change your pre-programmed seat, wheel, and mirror placements. The Tesla T logo brings up an overlay of all your vehicle's information and allows you to name your Tesla, which we'll do right now. And done. You can also view the release notes for the latest software update. The Bluetooth icon shows your connected devices and acts as a shortcut to connect a new device. To connect a device, make sure Bluetooth is on on the device you want to connect. Click Search on your touchscreen and tap the device you want to connect. A code will be shown and a pairing message will appear on your device. Click Pair and your device will connect to your Tesla. Once connected, sync data from your device to your Tesla. The signal icon shows your data connection strength and, when touched, allows you to connect to a local Wi-Fi network. If you didn't know, your Tesla is always connected to a cell signal to provide a data connection to the vehicle. And lastly, time. This shows the current time of day. Below all these shortcuts is your app row. These are the applications that come with your Tesla and include music, navigation, calendar, energy, web browser, camera, and phone. Each app can be displayed fully on the touchscreen, or by tapping the bottom left of the app, you can split the screen to show two apps simultaneously. In the bottom right-hand corner, you can swap which position, top or bottom, the app is active in. At the bottom of the screen, you'll find the Vehicle Controls button to access all controls and settings for your Tesla. Climate controls for the vehicle, including heated seat climate controls and audio volume. Volume can also be adjusted by the scroll wheel on the left side of the steering wheel. If you're in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. Once you've connected a phone to your Tesla, all your calendar events will sync with the vehicle and be accessible here. Within your calendar events, you can touch an address in the event to begin navigation to that address. Touch the phone number in an event to initiate a call, or tap the information icon to view notes within a calendar event. You can also program your Tesla to display a reminder of the day's events when you enter the vehicle. Enable this in your calendar settings by touching Controls, Settings, Apps, Calendar. Show calendar upon entry. If you are in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. Music provides you access to local radio, XM radio, internet radio, and My Music and Devices, which streams music from your mobile devices via Bluetooth or from a flash drive plugged into one of the USB ports. Favorites, and last, recently played. At any point, you can touch Now Playing to resume the main music screen. To adjust the sound in your Tesla, touch the Equalizer button, and you can adjust the tone and reposition the fade and balance of the car by touching and dragging. You can also search for music using the voice command button on your steering wheel. If you're in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. Navigation acts similar to Google Maps that you use on your phone or computer, providing you with satellite view and real-time traffic. On the right, we have the Places button. This loads up recent destinations you've traveled to. Favorites displays your home address, 
or other addresses you frequent often and have saved. The Chargers tab provides you with quick access to local charging destinations. The Tesla tab shows only Tesla supercharger stations for fast refueling while on longer trips. The Destination tab shows all Tesla destination charging locations. These are Tesla wall connectors at partnership locations. The last tab shows all charging locations. This includes all public, non-Tesla charging stations in addition to Tesla supercharger stations and destination charging locations. The Visited Chargers tab shows all recent charging locations you've connected to. Next in navigation is Search. Simply type in an address or business name to see results. You can also search for a destination using the voice command on the steering wheel. When the correct location pops up, just touch to begin navigation to that destination. Once navigation has begun, navigation automatically appears in the instrument cluster when routing to a destination. For long trips, your navigation will automatically plan a route including Tesla supercharger stations and provides you estimates on how long you will need to charge at each stop. The location button toggles the map between direction of travel up, north up, and displaying the remainder of a route that has been plugged into NAV. The electric bolt icon shows and hides charging locations on your map. If you are in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in the Model S. In this video, we'll cover all options within the Settings section of your Tesla. To access Settings, touch Controls on the lower left corner of the touchscreen, and then the Settings tab at the top. Within this menu, you can adjust settings for apps, driver profiles, units and formats, vehicle, safety and security, displays, home link, and driver assistance. In the lower left corner, you'll find the manual for your vehicle. Touch to load and browse. Within the app setting, you can adjust settings for installed apps. Apps which are grayed out have no settings that can be adjusted at this time. Driver profiles allow you to manage preferences for multiple drivers. Enter a name and touch Create Profile to save your seat, wheel, and mirror settings under your name. Driver profiles can also be accessed and adjusted via the driver profile icon at the top of the screen. Units and formats allow you to modify distance, time, temperature, and charging formats based on your preference or region. Vehicle settings allows you to modify the door unlock mode, turn child lock protection on or off. Walkaway door lock enables automatic locking of your doors when you walk away from the vehicle with the key. Auto present enables your door handles to automatically present when you walk up to the vehicle with the key. Unlock on Park unlocks the doors once Park is initiated. Lights enables the headlights to stay on momentarily after you exit the vehicle. Mirror Auto Tilt enables the exterior mirrors to tilt downward when reversing. Mirror Auto Fold, when enabled, folds exterior mirrors when you lock and leave your vehicle. They extend automatically when you return to your vehicle. Smart preconditioning, when enabled, predicts your driving schedule and automatically adjusts the temperature of the cabin based on your last set temperature and your driving schedule. The ionizer, when enabled, freshens air in the cabin. Safety and security settings allow you to enable parking assist chimes for when you come in close proximity of objects. Security alarm and mobile remote access that enables you to control your vehicle from My Tesla app on your phone. The display settings let you manually control the brightness and the day or night setting of the touchscreen and instrument panel. When set to auto, brightness changes automatically between day and night based on ambient lighting conditions. When auto adjust is checked, the displays are further adjusted based on both the surroundings and by learning your preferences. Clean mode disables the touchscreen momentarily for cleaning purposes. Simply press on the brake to re-engage the touchscreen. Power management puts your vehicle into an energy-saving mode to consume less energy when not in use. Homelink settings let you connect up to three of these devices to be controlled by your Tesla via an RF radio frequency signal, including garage doors, gates, lights, and security systems. To create a Homelink, enter the name of your device. Touch Create Homelink and follow the instructions for placing your RF remote in front of the car to scan for the RF signal. Once your signal has been memorized, you can now activate these systems by touching the Homelink icon at the top of the touchscreen.
The driver assistance enables features that provide a safer and more convenient driving experience. If your vehicle is equipped with driver assistance components, autopilot features can be enabled. With autopilot, you can enable auto steer, auto lane change, and summon. Summon allows your vehicle to park and unpark in your garage in coordination with Homelink to open or close your garage, adjust settings to enable narrow spaces, and stop distance preference. Lane Assist provides side collision warnings and lane departure warnings in your instrument cluster by vibrating the steering wheel. Speed Assist enables you to set a speed limit reminder via your display or a chime to let you know you're surpassing the speed limit of the road. You can make this setting relative or absolute and offset the speed to your own preference. Speed limit also affects the speed to which traffic aware cruise control will default when engaged. Collision Avoidance Assist provides a forward collision warning that displays warnings when a frontal collision is considered likely. Additionally, you can enable or disable automatic emergency braking that occurs to minimize the impact of a collision. If you are in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The Tesla Motors app puts Tesla owners in direct communication with their cars anytime, anywhere. Once downloaded from your phone app store, log in to gain access to your vehicle. Once logged in, on the home screen, you'll be shown the overall status of your vehicle. This includes your vehicle's name, any open doors, front trunk, trunk, or sunroof, and the current estimated range of your vehicle. If you have Summon enabled and within range, you'll see a Summon button above the car. To use this feature, touch Summon and then press and hold forward or reverse to engage Summon. Summon will automatically open or close your garage to park or unpark for your convenience. Touch controls to access your vehicle controls. These include venting and closing your sunroof, locking and unlocking the doors remotely, honking the horn and flashing the headlights. Touch charge to modify your charge limit. Drag the slider to modify the limit you want to charge your vehicle to. Touch climate to set the vehicle's internal temperature remotely. This is a convenient way to cool or heat your vehicle before getting in. At the top right, you can turn climate controls on or off, and below, you can change the temperature to your desired preference. Touch location to load up location features. Here you can see where your vehicle is and where you are in relation. View in map or satellite view. And by touching directions on the top right, you'll be taken to your phone's default Maps app to acquire directions. Beyond these controls, touch the top left button to reveal a sidebar menu. In the sidebar menu, you have the main controls, which we just reviewed. Valet mode, notification settings, calendar, and sign out. Valet mode is a feature you can enable that restricts access to your vehicle when handing it over to a valet. Restrictions include hiding all personal data from your touchscreen, locking the glove box and frunk and limit the maximum speed your vehicle can achieve. Notifications is where you can enable or disable notifications from your vehicle. Just touch to enable any notifications you would like. Calendar assists with providing access to your phone's calendar when connected to your vehicle via Bluetooth. Additionally, it provides an overview of what functions are enabled in your vehicle. Lastly, sign out. Use this to sign out of your Tesla Motors app if you ever need. If you're in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. The phone app allows you to make and receive calls once you've paired a phone with your Tesla. You can make phone calls by using the on-screen dialer, touching a contact in your recent calls, contact list, or speaking a voice command while pressing the voice button on the steering wheel. To receive a phone call, touch answer on your touchscreen or use the scroll wheel on the right side of your steering column to accept. If you're in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. The camera allows you to display what the high-definition rear-view camera sees at any time. When in reverse, guidelines appear and move with the steering wheel to show your trajectory. 
always be sure to check your surroundings and use your mirrors. The camera is an aid and should not be relied upon for rear view. If you're in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. The web browser is a full-featured browser for accessing the internet. The browser can be loaded full screen or split screen with another app. Use this feature as an extension of your mobile office for accessing information when needed or your passenger can use during driving. Please note, do not use the web browser while driving your vehicle for your safety and the safety of others on the road. If you are in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. The Energy app will give you feedback on how your driving habits are impacting the expected range of your vehicle. While viewing the consumption graph, you will see how much energy your vehicle has consumed over the past 5, 15, or 30 miles how this compares to the EPA-rated range, and what your projected range would be if you continue to drive in this manner. The consumption graph can also be displayed on the instrument panel behind the steering wheel. The trip chart will monitor the amount of energy being used while navigating to a destination, and will also track your actual usage against the initial prediction. If you are in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752. The touchscreen is your control panel for accessing functions, features, and apps in your Tesla. In this video, we'll review all options within the control section of your Tesla. To access controls, touch Controls on the lower left corner of the touchscreen. In the Controls menu, the top half of the screen has tabs for controlling the sunroof, suspension, driving, cold weather, trips, displays, e-brake, and power-off controls. On the bottom half of the screen, Controls for the doors, locks, and lights are always present. If equipped, sunroof controls allow you to open, vent, and close the sunroof precisely how you want. You can drag the slider on the right-hand side or touch and slide the sunroof with your finger. Additionally, the sunroof can be adjusted from the steering wheel scroll wheel. Suspension controls enable you to adjust the ride height of your Tesla if your Tesla is equipped with the optional smart air suspension and enable automatic lowering for optimal freeway driving. Model S can also automatically adjust suspension height based off GPS location when needed. If you're ever required to raise your vehicle with a jack, enable jack mode here before doing so. See your manual before jacking up your vehicle for additional information about jack points. Driving controls enables adjustment of the steering mode, which modifies the sensitivity of the steering wheel. These modes include comfort, standard, and sport. Acceleration allows you to modify the vehicle's acceleration ability. Sport is the standard level of acceleration. Choose Ludicrous to increase peak torque by approximately 60%. Ludicrous mode is only available with the optional performance upgrade on specific models. Creep mode, when enabled, will slowly move your vehicle forward when in drive or reverse when you release the brake, similar to a conventional vehicle with automatic transmission. If you turn off traction control or enable slip start, a warning message displays on the instrument panel. Traction control turns off for the current drive only. On dual motor vehicles, traction control is automatically turned back on when the speed exceeds 40 miles per hour. Regenerative braking slows the vehicle down as you lift off the accelerator pedal. It recaptures the energy from you moving forward and returns it to the battery. If set to low, range decreases and the vehicle will coast as the accelerator pedal is released. Range mode automatically limits the amount of power that the climate control system uses to maintain the temperature of the battery and the cabin area. If equipped with the optional cold weather package, cold weather controls enables control of all seat heaters as well as the heated wipers and steering wheel. Heaters that are turned on are displayed in red. You can touch each seat individually to change the amount of heat and also control the front driver and passenger seats using the main climate control panel located on the bottom of the touchscreen. In the trips controls, you can view and reset the trip meters that summarize a trip you've designated to be tracked. Trips information can also be displayed on the instrument panel behind the steering wheel. The display controls let you manually control the brightness and the day or night setting for the touchscreen and instrument panel. 
When set to auto, brightness changes automatically between day and night based on ambient lighting conditions. When auto adjust is checked, the displays are further adjusted based on both the surroundings and by learning your preferences. Clean mode disables the touchscreen momentarily for cleaning purposes. Simply press on the brake to re-engage the touchscreen. Power management puts your vehicle into an energy-saving mode to consume less energy when it's not in use. E-brake and power off controls enables you to manually apply and release the parking brake and power off the vehicle. The parking brake is automatically set anytime your Tesla is in park. Powering off the vehicle doesn't cut power from the battery. Rather, it just powers off the displays and interior lights as if the car is parked. If you are in need of additional assistance, you can reach Tesla support at 844-248-3752.